Now that the hammers have dried on the action stack, it's time to remove the hammers from the action stack, trim the hammer shanks, and arc the tails. This is a very loud process, so I'm actually not going to show it to you live, but I'll br briefly explain it. This is my bandsaw, and what I'm going to do here is show you that, you know, we would take a hammer shank that's too long and take it up to the bandsaw blade and simply trim it off. And here you can see the trimmings off of three hammers that I've already done. Once the shank has been trimmed off, I can go to my sanding machine over here and I've got a little jig set up. This will allow me to arc the tails and um, this, this jig I made myself, it uh, swivels and gives a perfect 14 degree arc to the tail. And it's held firmly where you bring it up to the sanding disc and then you simply rotate it and it sands away the excess tail material. So the steps of this of course are pretty simple then in summary. We have a hammer shank that's too long there and now we have one that's been trimmed and now the final product an arced tail.